when you look at your regulation and we understand what you're talking about is flexibility but flexibility within which what kind of guidelines I think is is the real question mm -hmm. so so will there be targets on amounts what uh, you know per ton limitations what are you looking at administrator well I think we've been talking uh, mostly about uh, rates not not ton caps this is not a cap and trade program it's not going to be designed like a cap and trade program. For the most part, our rules are how much rate of pollution can you have for a specific ton, uh, I'm sorry, a megawatt. And I don't know whether that's going to land, but that's been where the, the most discussion has been. This is not, this not, is not an opportunity for us to impose a cap. Um, that's not what it looks like. Um, that's not what it's anticipated. I don't think that's really the, the structure of the, the requirement, um, but so we've been for the most part discussing it as a rate um, at, uh, opportunity uh, as, and not really looking at this as a, an, end, an end cap either on a state or on, on a regional level or national level. As Minister, now maybe everybody understood that, but uh, I'm going to ask you to explain it a little further. I'm, I'm on the Energy Committee yeah. in the Senate. Uh -huh. And the Congress rejected cap and trade, That's which right. deals with limitation of CO2 it did emissions. Not pass it, yes. Yet the EPA and the administration is going to go ahead and set limits. Now, if you say that isn't a cap, it's a rate issue. Can you explain that? Because I, I don't understand. Yeah. Well, uh, l let me let me be very clear. <clears throat> what we're doing is is setting a limit for an emission of a pollutant, which is carbon. That's what this is. It is not taking the place of what Congress can do in a broader context. And when I'm making a distinction between a cap and a rate, I'm recognizing that this state has expanded energy needs. I'm recognizing what you just said, that you need, you need to continue to grow the, e the energy generation here because you're having larger population growth and you need to service that. I'm just trying to assure you that we're not arbitrarily picking a number that everybody needs to meet. We're looking at individual states and that the primary way we regulate pollutants is not to say how much everybody can do, but to try to, to set a rate that is achievable. That's how we generally regulate. And so that's the reason why we're going out, is to see, is, is this the best way to do it? Are there other ways to do it? And to make sure that anything we propose is actually achievable. That's what we're looking to do. But the industry is saying for a new plant, the standards that you're setting is not achievable. And what you're hearing here is that the standard you're talking about setting is either not achievable or only achievable at such a high price that Consumers, as Marshall said, would, would pay a price they just can't afford. Well, Senator, I, we're in the middle of the comment period on the one, and I haven't even started on the second. So what I'm asking you to do is to just do as you're doing today. Be as honest with us as you can. Send in your comments. We'll consider those. And frankly, you need to be as upfront as you possibly can on the existing facilities about what concerns you. I have met with the presidents of most of the, the unions, asking them the same question. You know, the last thing we want is to have this rule impact the ability of the economy to grow in any state, never mind nationally. And we're going to do the best we can to design this so that it is consistent with the direction that you want to head economically, as well as addressing what we believe to be a very significant public health challenge. And so we'll, we'll do our best and we'll work through the comment process. But we're here even prior to developing it. So let, let's not jump to conclusions about what, what it can and can't be. Let's get our heads out as far as we can go about exchanging information and see how well we can do.